Gabriel joins us once again to tell us that Guyana's first people's history and archaeology were highlighted on Thursday at the inaugural Indigenous Education Lecture at the Humaniana Georgetown. The theme for this year's celebration is Guyana's first peoples, sustaining a rich cultural environment. The lecture was facilitated by the Amerindian Development Fund to better understand and appreciate the indigenous heritage. Persons often read about indigenous peoples from a colonial perspective. Archaeology lecturer Louisa Daggers gives a synopsis of archaeological research and evidence discovered based on the local indigenous people. From the beginning, symbolization, pet, looking at petroglyphs and our ability to use language today, um, to the use of and modifying of the landscape to manipulate resource availability and population growth through time. And also looking at how indigenous populations would have adapted to the environment as a result of climate change. Because this is um, a topic that's new to us, but it's not, very, it's not new to indigenous populations. They've lived through climate change. This is just another phase of it that they're going through. And I think we can really learn a whole lot from those populations if we uh, spend a lot more time with them. Persons were also informed of the interactions between indigenous peoples and the early European explorers. Renowned historian Anna Benjamin discussed the arrival of the Dutch and the myth that indigenous people were victims of the Europeans and genocide. The seminars run from 11th of September to the 22nd at the Humaniano. Zanil Williams for InfoHub.